You guessed correctly. I still like NFTs. I'm still trading them. I'm still doing my own research and I'm still looking into upcoming projects every single day. I know it's been a month since my last upload. I do apologize. But in other news, the market's looking really good. There's a lot of hype. There's a lot of community overall engagement. And there's a few upcoming projects I want to talk about. So in today's video, I want to talk about the market, talk about Solana, talk about upcoming projects on the Solana blockchain, and give you my own opinions. Never financial advice, not financial advice. I'm my own dude, doing my own thing, looking at my own stuff. Do your own research. Have a great day. Hit the like button, subscribe, comment down below, and let's hop on into it. If you've been anywhere in the Solana space for the past month, you've probably heard of The Bastards. One of the most thought out art projects we've yet to seen, built by a massive art studio called Sky Punch, the same artist behind the Experiments Collection, my own in NFT project. The Bastards is delivering a high effort, high energy, and creative thought process behind their trailers, their scenery work, and their NFT project as well. There isn't a lot of information behind the Bastards as of just yet. There isn't a lot of public stuff out there to the people. But I think the Bastards is going to be one of those projects you will know and remember for a very long time in the Solana space. The Twitter made a beautiful announcement about a month ago now with their first ever trailer we've yet to seen, and it included quite a surprise to the Solana space. I do have the Bastards pre-sale deck here as well, which kind of goes through what they're talking about, what they're going to be aiming to kind of like give you guys their constitution, their posse. As you guys can see, Jersey is on there. I am an advisor for the Bastards team. And we got Danilo rocking the beautiful experiments PFP. What's up, dude? On top of that, the animation studio is Sky Punch, like I mentioned earlier. It's a massive team with a bunch of goals that they're going to be portraying throughout the Solana space and Ethereum, maybe, maybe Polygon. I don't know why, but maybe. And overall, I think we're in for a huge welcoming to the Bastards community when they drop their products, opportunities, their constitution, their community, and overall just our efforts behind the project. Next up, I do want to talk about Soul Casino. Soul Casino has been around since I've been in Solana. Last year in December, or no, two years ago in December. I've been here for almost a little bit over a year now. You guys know what I mean. But Soul Casino is dropping their PFP project. There's these bears and these bulls, I think. Pretty decent artwork. I do like it a lot as what we've seen so far. But Soul Casino is what it says. It is a casino where you can bet Solana, Ethereum, other SPL tokens, yada, yada, yada. Crypto-based casino dropping an NFT project can raise a little bit of, you know, questions. Mainly because they've been out for a year. What do they need the funding for now? Again, this is one of those projects that does not have a lot of information out on it as of yet. What we do know and what has been sort of sneak peeked or kind of like, you know, hinted at that there will be some sort of revenue share platform behind the PFP and from their profits or fees or what they take home from the casino back to the NFT and PFP holders. I do want to talk about Low Life Forms, a project that is gaining a bunch of attention, a lot of anticipation, and dropping some beautiful trailers as well from their third-person sci-fi action-based game. I gotta be honest, this is probably one of the most high effort based games I've seen on Solana or even on Ethereum or Polygon of all time. I don't know, I love sci-fi shooters like this, PvP, PvE, loot em and shoot em, styled games, and this thing looks polished, it looks really good. But besides that, we are getting a bunch of sneak peeks. They're gaining quite a bit of attention as well over on their Twitter, and they just dropped their first trailer, I think two or three days ago. But this project and this game is built out by a fully doxxed company that was founded back in 2018. They are VC funded as well. They're built up from AAA Gaming Studio. The team is compiled of some AAA Gaming Studio individuals, and they will be dropping their PvP shooter first. Let me show you guys the website, because this is probably one of the most thought out, effort backed. I don't know, this website's just insane. I've never seen something so creative and so smooth with gameplay on the website in the back end. It just looks so good, man. But there are going to be multiple episodes, is what they call them throughout their roadmap. Dropping their PvP game, their co-op loot em and shoot em game, their collabs, their play to earn aspects, and then their modding. So from my understanding, you'll be able to mod almost every single game that you are entering to kind of like your standard or join lobbies that have modded gameplay. Meaning you control your game, you make it how you want to, you set the rules, you have the fun. But here we have the roadmap coming out through the research and development, the prototype, and then having their playable game, and then dropping more campaigns behind their teasers, their trailers, and the new game modes and new episodes, and then launching, of course, their NFT collection. The first drop is going to be in February, as it states, the Gen 1 collection of 33, 33 playable characters. And there will be some NFT airdrops. There will be some alpha and NFT drops as well. And there's going to be beta playing, beta access, alpha gaming, and then the full launch of the game as well with more NFTs and more utility backed behind the gameplay, the play to earn. And I just think the overall effort and quality behind what Low Life Forms is doing is going to be a big fucking hit for Solana. 
I'm glad they're launching on Soul, let's be honest. So there are going to be kind of like rarities and factions based behind the PFPs of the collection with playable characters as well for their game. And then playing as your PFP, playing as your NFT will give you, of course, those rewards you're looking for when playing a shooter like this. And I'm hoping there's going to be a leaderboard because your boy wants to rank up on that PVP. I want to play this game on stream. Let me say that first. I'm very excited to get my hands on this when it does drop. I just think it's going to be a massive hit. We see games fail all the time, which sucks, right? So my camera died while recording. I didn't realize it until I was editing the video, which kind of sucks. But low life forms, what I was saying was they have the VC funding. They have a massive team. They have the AAA studio feel. They have the needs and the wants and the requirements to build this game out and to have that play to earn that metaverse feel to it and bring it over to the Solana blockchain in a timely manner and have it ready to go. What I was saying was we see a lot of projects want to drop games and they use their NFT as funding for it. These guys have a trailer. They have gameplay. They already have this polished look and feel. Whereas most games that come out, they kind of, you know, need funding to build it out and it takes them a year after they drop an NFT. I think Low Life Forms already has that ready to go. They've already skipped the, you know, let's fund it from the NFT. Let's, let's, let's waste time, right? Let's get people hyped up and then give it to them a year later. Rather, they've already got the funding. They already have the game and they're just ready to fucking go. So Low Life Forms, guys, give them a follow. Check them out for yourselves. I want to play this game on stream. I want to learn more. I want to do more. I think it's a dope team as well. Yeah, do your own research, of course, on any of these projects. Also, I'll be getting whitelist for these guys. So uh, join experiments. That's all you got to do. I do want to talk about the heist as well. Coming up, 20,000 followers in just a little over a month as well. 71,000 impressions, 44,000 impressions, 45, 49,000. They've just been releasing scenery pieces of artwork. And what we've got so far is going to be a high risk, high reward styled game built out by the Remnants team, Longwood Labs. The heist.game, their website, as it states, built out by Longwood Labs, the same people behind the Remnants team. There's nothing yet on the website, but it's okay. The scenery artwork is beautiful. The Discord just got released as well about, what, two weeks ago, I want to say? And we do have access to the Heist game presale pitch deck as well. A high-stakes, risk-based game of crime, corruption, and bananas. Placing a new twist on the old-school game like Wolf Game. So there's a little bit of some correlation here behind them, I think. Think reviving, revamping, and going for that cops game, cops and robbers, wolf game appeal that we need on Solana. Pretty big team as well. We got Juice and Bison as the project leads. And then we have the Longwood Labs team, which is like the developers, the CEOs, and everyone in between the game design. And they do have a pretty stacked team as advisors. Dylan, turned up Dylan over from Dead King Society. And then a bunch of other guys. I don't know them all. I'm sorry. But we see some Boogles, we see some more Dead King PFPs, and some Moonbirds as well. Overall, I think the heist is going to be a very likable, playable game that people are going to enjoy for the long run in Solana. And I think if they can pull off that Cops and Robbers or that Wolf game appeal and do it long term to make it sustainable, I think it'll be one for the books if they do it correctly. I'm hyped for it though. Four pretty hyped up projects coming to a Solana blockchain near you very soon. Guys, thank you for watching. I'm going to upload more videos soon. I hope so. I'm going to try my best to do it. I am streaming three to four times a week over on YouTube on this channel. So subscribe and I stream over on kick.com slash barzy every now and then. Have a great day, guys. Thank you for watching. Join experiments if you have not already. My personal project on the Solana blockchain. A bunch of stuff coming soon. Don't say you weren't warned. Have a great day. I'll see you next time. Peace out.